Good morning, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. AG Flag Football League fined 2K for allowing teams outside New England to compete in tournament. AG's office says teams from Ohio, Pennsylvania, Wisconsin competed. The New England Flag Football League has been fined 2000 for allegedly allowing teams from outside of New England to compete in a tournament last month. According to the State Attorney General's Office, officials with the Attorney General's Office confirm that the fine is the first to be issued to anyone in New Hampshire for violating the governor's COVID-19 orders. Officials said state and local officials reportedly notified the league before the tournament in Epping that only teams from New England were allowed to compete. We were in communication with him trying to confirm in the first instance whether there were some other teams we weren't aware of of other than a New York team that was not going to be allowed to attend, said Associate Attorney General Anna Edwards. And then we were just trying to continually confirm our information about the guidance so that he did understand that only New England teams could compete. In the notice sent to the league, officials said the league allegedly allowed four Ohio teams and two teams from Pennsylvania and Wisconsin to compete. According to a notice sent to the league president Austin Bradshaw on August 19th, two days before the tournament, to restrict that teams from outside New England could not participate. News 9 reached out to Bradshaw the same day and gave a statement after his call with the Attorney General's Office. He said they would inform the teams from outside of New England and adhere to the COVID-19 guidelines. But that did not happen. The Attorney General's Office said that did not happen though. Edward said the league reached out quickly and paid the $2,000 fine. She said that as far as she knows, no cases of COVID-19 have been tied to the tournament. And that does it for this morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. Thank you for watching this morning news report. Have a great rest of your day. See you back here later on today for another news report. Goodbye, everyone.